hi everyone welcome to my youtube channel in this tutorial we are going to replace the components of an assembly with a point mass while maintaining all these model characteristics characteristic of assembly same so here we are going to import geometry then structural structure static structural standalone system then model and another one also model in the first model we are going to do model analysis with the all the assembly files and uh, in other one uh, we will simplify that model so here we will rename it as a global model and another one we will rename that simplified model okay so right click here and import geometry so we are going to import uh, the assembly solid stp file now we will double click on the static structure this is static structure we have taken to get uh, uh, like mass and other uh, details of so here we are going to check first unit okay then we are going to suppress first body L last two body we are going to uh, get uh, mass up from this uh, static structure so here what we will do we will uh, create a mess so we will insert sizing here so that we will select both body and element size we will take uh, 5 mm okay then generate mass so here using APDL command we are going to get uh, details of the two body mass and the center of mass and other things so what we will do here we will insert uh, command and here we are going to type IRLF comma dash one so now we are going to run uh, this solve so we are going to solution and now we are going to search precise mass precise so here this has come so we can see this one and we can take uh, uh, a snapshot of this because we have to enter all the details many of these details to other simplified model so what we will do here go to snipping tool then take a snapshot of this okay now we are going to close all these things now go to model double click here and then check units ok here we are going to generate mass inserting sizing 5mm for all these three bodies and element size 5 mm okay then generate mass insert frictionless support and select all nine bodies okay apply then solve so now we are going to solve it or also we can check analysis setting six modes we are taking here okay then solve so here we can see frequency for all six modes we are going to export to compare with the simplified model okay same so now we can 
select all create mode safe results then so evaluate all results so here we can go to results and click on vector you can change also from here the size of the vectors so here we can see the deformation how it is deforming at the particular frequency that's in y direction okay so now we are going to close it and uh, now we are going to simplified model there we will double click on this okay units and now we are going to suppress the two body okay now add coordinate now we are going to add coordinate system okay insert and here we are going to change from geometry selection to global coordinates global coordinates okay so now whatever it, it was there like uh, snapshot minus 7610 this all these xyz details we are we have entered here okay insert point mass now we are going to enter point mass using this surface apply then change global coordinate to coordinate system and enter all this mass and mass movement of inertia about x y and z axis using this snapshot okay and also behavior from deformable to rigid okay now we are going to generate insert sizing here select this body and apply element size 5 mm okay generate mass Mass has been generated now. Insert frictionless support. Select all nine bodies. So if we see this mass, it is going at offset. I think there is some problem. So what we have to see here we are going to check coordinate system 0 0 we are going to make all this x y z it's showing some problem so 0 0 mm we are going to put then uh, at the uh, specified coordinate now mass has been applied now we are going to solve okay so here we can see this frequency and we can compare with the our first uh, model so this is somewhat similar like 380 and here 386 something and there 426 here 446 so it is somewhat similar okay thank you very much please like and subscribe my channel okay bye